Well, I've been working on wiring for the last several days and it's, uh, it's coming along. It's not the most exciting thing to film or to do, I guess, so I haven't filmed a lot of it. So I'll just show you some progress. I changed the um, big nest of uh, wires into a big nest of looms and uh, so obviously a lot of wire looms. I've got it secured pretty well and it comes down. Actually the entire uh, engine harness is all completely finished now and um, yeah, the engine actually the wiring is, is pretty much done. One thing to do still is the O2 sensor. And then what I ended up doing in the battery box here is I have everything mounted now. So the battery is secured. I ended up using, so this is the, the GM fuse block and uh, I've pared it down to just basically uh, some things that I need and then a bunch of extras. These actually are mostly all extra wires and I'll, I'll find a use for some of them and the other ones I'll just um, basically just keep them as spares for if I ever expand. The mega squirt is all mounted up now. This is a grounding bus. So all the grounds on the, uh, from basically everywhere on the boat will come back to here. Uh, except for the mega squirt is grounded directly to the battery and uh, I have a, a heavy ground from the engine block as well. So that's all finished up. I made this extra relay block here. So right now I have five relays. I think I'm only using three of them right now or four of them. Uh, so I have an extra one there. Then the, the wiring, it runs all the way up. I made this dash. So it, the dash, um, I wanted it fairly small. I didn't want it in the way of legroom. Obviously lots of toggles, more toggles than I need right now, but I might use them at a certain point. I have a Hobbs meter. This is the switch for the uh, fan or the, the heater core and the fan under there. And then the ignition switch. I also have an accessory fuse block at the top here. So most of, basically all the switches on the front here will be getting power from here. Some of them will be going directly to whatever they're switching. And then some of them will go back to uh, a, a relay or, uh, well basically a relay in the battery box and then power from there. But that's all coming together. And that's the wiring for now. Um, there's a bit more to do to finish it up. And uh, I'll basically just finish up the rest of the wiring and uh, then pretty soon it's time to move on to the next step. Thanks for watching.